Welcome back. Today I'm doing a room tour for GRC at VCU. So I'm in a semi-suite. I know when I was applying to VCU and looking at all the dorms and seeing where I wanted to stay, I would look up like room tours and there weren't a lot. And the ones I did see weren't that in depth. Like I really had no idea like the layout of like the bathroom and how much space we had. All right, so here's our door. Nothing special, but that is special. We have our own thermostat, which a lot of dorms don't have. Hi. Hey. I'm her mess. You don't want to see. We don't need to go in there. It's okay. <laughs> then we have the first mirror. So this is my roommate's mirror. And then here's a sliding, like it's like a barn door, you know? It goes into my suite mate's room and there's the bathroom. So it's like a hallway and you can't lock these. I know I was really curious about these doors, but you can't lock them, which is fine because I like my suite mates. But if you don't, that's awkward. And then right on the other side, we have our vanity. So this is my side. We have a lot of under space, lots of, oh, you know, the stuff you need. And these open, even more storage, super nice. There's a light switch right here. Turn off the vanity light. And then here's my closet. This is what the closet looks like inside. All my stuff. I have food up there, towels and plates and everything you could imagine. And there's a pretty good amount of space. Like it's not horrible, especially for a dorm. Both these slides open, just in case you didn't know that. And then over here is the desk. That's my roommate's desk. And then we have our mini fridge and microwave duo. It's not too, I mean, they're not big, but you know, it's decent, I guess. The microwave is pretty small though. It doesn't fit anything tall. Like my mom said when she first got here, you're not gonna fit a venti drink in there. So don't get one. And then here's my desk. It's kind of smaller than I thought it would be. The pictures are like fisheye. I thought the desk would be bigger, but I got a desk hutch. So I have all my school supplies, my notebooks, all that, pens, pencils, everything. My makeup printer and a little calendar that I did hand draw. That's why it looks horrible. Into my mirror. Hey guys, I have my jewelry stuff. I got those from Amazon. Also, the desk chairs are awful. They're horrible. So I just had this pillow for my bed. I just stuck it on there because no, they're so uncomfortable. And then here's our view. So I get a view of literally everyone else's room. If you don't close your blinds, you can see people changing. So close your blinds. And I don't have a great view. Some people have like the city. Also in the pictures, it looks like this is a full length window, which some people have those, but most people don't. And then I have a little cart. It's kind of messy, but that's okay. And here's my bed. The beds are a decent size, but I definitely suggest getting a mattress topper because it's not very comfortable. And then underneath the bed, we have dressers and there's a little bit of room on each side if you wanna like push them to the corner and add something else under there, but you can't fit a lot. And then I got this little poof thing from Target. This is what the drawers look like. Like for example, these are only sweatpants, so they're not the biggest, I guess. I mean, I got a lot of sweatpants in there, but... And the top ones lock, so if you bring a lock, you wanna lock up all your stuff, that's perfect. And here's what the bathroom looks like. It's not too small. The showers, you get a little stand for everyone, you and your sweet mates. Um, our towel rack fell off the wall, my bad. Here's the toilet. I don't think you'd be able to fit anything else in here. We are gonna get a little stand for towels, but I don't know about that anymore. So yeah, that's our room. It's kind of awesome. It's like a little hotel. I love it here. If you are gonna come here and you want a suite, now you know what it looks like. They're pretty awesome, guys. 